Good morning. This is Anka Metcalf with TradeOutloud.com. And uh, today is Monday, August 12, 2013, and it is very close to 10 a.m. Eastern Time. Now, for our favorite trade of the week, we turn our attention to a very interesting chart pattern into the pound dollar. In front of us, we have an hourly chart of the pound dollar. So notice the uptrend that has developed onto this time frame. Now, what happened in this currency pair is that you see this pivot point low, this low right here, it has formed a price support level right into this area of, uh, and actually it is a fulcrum area of 5480, that is 1.5480. Now, today what happened uh, we opened right here into this area where my cursor is at 55, five, let me just put the cursor right here, 5510 five, approximately. And then we sold off in the European session slightly. And we've we formed another level of support just briefly under 1.54660. So right here, right into this area. So I would consider the 54. 5.5 five area is being a major support area in this case as well. So notice the price action that has been going here and note that this is a one hour chart. So for more than five hours, five to six hours, we have been consolidating into this region. Now the fact that we are consolidating into this region means that we're eating up all this previous uh, support that is right now resistance into this price range and it's trying to move higher. Notice the trend line support right here that is cradling the price at this level. So here's the game plan for this week for short and medium term traders. We're looking at an entry and I already have an entry right here at 1.5480 and with a protective stop under 5455 right here into this area. And our first target area is at 1.5550, which is right here into the fulcrum area. Let me just pinpoint this uh, right here. So this is the area. And then we're looking for a much higher target into a whole number, into 1.5600, which you can only see if we visit the daily chart. So onto the daily chart, we're going to move into 5. Five six zero zero. So oh, okay. Here's the area. Here is the next target area. So you can see from the daily chart that this is the pivot that we're gonna reach our first target. And remember, the first targets are amongst the first and the easiest to reach. And then currencies tend to pull back a little and then continue. Uh, if the price, uh, if the price and the technicals are there, then the pr then the price will rise towards uh, the second target direction. So just to recap briefly, let's go back to the early chart. We have a buy signal that you could see it right here. So I am in this trade currently right now. So this is my entry price where you see the horizontal line. I have a very tight stop right here where my cursor is. And my stop is of about 25 pips. I'm looking for a first target, like I said, into the 5550 area which is this area right here, that would give me about 70 pips. So that is a good risk to reward for me in this particular trade. And then target two, like I said, we're looking for a whole number and that is for a medium term um, a chart, a medium term chart trade. So we're looking for a continuation higher. This was all for today. Remember to subscri subscribe to our YouTube channel for more updates on this trade and many more other trades. And like us on our Facebook page at facebook.com slash tradeoutloud. Thank you and see you soon.